you know, but at the moment, could you please cease your filming? No. This Ridley O is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. So, at this moment in time, again, we're going to have that communications officer, and we're more than happy to discuss about the filming of, of the board meeting. You know, but at the moment, could you please cease your filming? No. No? Okay. Are you on the board? Hi. Are you on the board? Question for you. Do you support the restrictions on filming civic events in the library? Are you on the board? I am. Oh, a question for you. Yes. Do you support restrictions on filming in the libraries, even at civic events uh, like this? I don't know. I'm not on the board. Oh, I thought, I thought you said you were. I apologize. No, I'm not. Sorry. Oh, I'm talking too loud. It's a library. All right. Thank you. Are you on the board? I'm not. Okay, thank you. Are you on the board? No, sir. Okay. Oh, the filmer. Hi, how are you? He's disrupting everything. The communications guy? You're talking louder than I am. <laughs> <laughs> now, I was listening to the conversation, and the question is, okay, so how were you disrupting things? You haven't done it. Oh, thank you. You haven't seen anything yet, so well, you know don't be too quick to judge me, innocent. You know, judging is something I tend not to do. Oh, well, thank you. I find it's easier to inquire. So, uh, what is this about a ban on, or a restriction on filming? Are you on the library board? I'm the library director. Oh, hi. hi. Dave Ridley, RidleyReport.com. Oh, nice to meet you again. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the library, uh, established by law, is a limited public forum. Yeah. Hammer versus Morristown Police Department. We are allowed to ask you not to record. That is settled case law. So what happens to me if I continue recording, as I am You're going to do? violation of our code of conduct and our photography policy. Are you familiar with that decision, sir? I have read some of it. Not the decision, but I've read some of what's on your website. And that's why I'm here, because I'm disturbed by that. It's completely... Yeah. So libraries are not full public forums. Libraries are limited public forums. I fully support what you're trying to do to prove the robustness of the First Amendment. The First Amendment also protects patrons and library users' rights to be recorded. Privacy is also a part of it. Can you quote the, the First Amendment to me? The First Amendment? Mm -hmm. So make no law establishing... <sighs> oh, gosh. You're just as good as I am at this. I'm not yeah, saying I know more than you, press, freedom but... Of religion, freedom of speech, freedom of assembly, and freedom of petition to government. Sir, I There's nothing in the First Amendment that restricts me from filming this. I think you're aware that the amendments to the Constitution are built and given life by case law. And I respect the First Amendment. I would hope that you would respect the First Amendment rights of people in the library to be free of having their exercise of the First Amendment being recorded and displayed. That has also been established by case law, sir. So they have a First Amendment to do what to me exactly? They have a First Amendment right, right to privacy as really? well. Really? Where is that yes. in the First Amendment? Sir, are you a lawyer? I'm not either. I just know how to read. <laughs> I've read it a couple times. LRN.FM, 24 hours of Liberty Radio every day. Now available on satellite, too.
at sat.lrn.fm. That's what a satellite sounds like. Put it on your unlicensed station. Wear it in your hair. But above all, don't despair. The Liberty message is getting out. And right now, you're missing it. Or maybe you're not. But skip on over to LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them.